Hi everyone, I am Sandhi Puri and I am a second year MBBS student at Maulana Azad Medical College. So this video is going to be about the 3 hours of my neat experience that I gave in 2022. So uh, when I the I remember there were so many so many kids and their parents and obviously when you see so many people all at once and you know that you are competing against them, it gets a little intimidating. So, uh, so that thought came into my mind for a split second ki itne sare logon mein se matlab how exactly will I get selected or how exactly will I make it. But I think us din pe it's very important that you keep your focus aur aap matlab us bheed ko bhul jao aur aap sirf ye focus karo ki aapne jo padha hai wo three hours mein you can just do justice to that. So I didn't think about it too much and I just entered the center and I sat down and I just took a short nap before the paper began. Uh, and ha, I figured out that washroom wagera kahan par hai so that if I have to go during the paper, then it's not time waste now. So that's something I did before the paper. Now, uh, once I got the paper, I started off with biology like most aspirants do. But what happened was that the first question, and I very vividly remember the first question, it was about the process of translation. How do we bind the subunit from mRNA for translation to begin? So for some reason, I just could not recollect the answer to this question. I mean, I was showing an exact page in NCRT in which I had written the answer, but I didn't remember the answer again. I just marked something and ultimately I just ended up getting it incorrect. But I moved on to the next question. And the rest of the bio was mostly solvable. It was lengthy, but it was in NCRT and it was solvable. So after, uh, once I was done with bio, I just saw the time. And I was really surprised because 1 hour 30 minutes had passed and that was a lot of time for me. I think even more than that had passed. And usually I had mock tests in 25-30 minutes at max for both the sections of biology. So 1 hour 30 minutes was a lot more than So at that point I did get a little scared that the rest of 90 minutes will be in physics chemistry because you know they have more calculations also. If you have 90 in bio. But then I think this point is very important that you keep your calm. Even more than what you've studied, this point is very important that you see that almost every time they try to make a balanced paper. So if one subject is very lengthy or very difficult, more often than not, the other subjects will be lighter or they will be easier to solve. But if you panic, you won't see that the other subjects are easier and you will end up making mistakes over there. So, you know, I have to shift my focus on that I have to do physics and chemistry and it will happen. Hopefully, they will be easier. And they were easier. They were much easier than biology that year. So, I started off with physics and it really didn't take too much time. It wasn't very much calculation based. And in physics, I had honestly questions. I mean, it was in flow. I don't think there was any question in which I had doubt. And eventually also, I ended up getting a full score in physics that year. So, physics for me was pretty easy that time. बस मैं ये ध्यान रखती थी कि करेक्ट इनकरेक्ट कहाँ लिखा है स्टेटमेंट्स में या फिर कुछ स्पेसिफिक चीज मतलब एंगल ऑफ इंसिडेंस पूछा है रिफ्लेक्शन रिफ्लेक्शन वो सब कंफ्यूजन ना हो जो बेसिक कीवर्ड्स में कंफ्यूजन होती है आई वाज जस्ट ट्राइंग टू मेक शर्ट अबाउट दैट बाकी तो कैलकुलेशन पार्ट वाज प्र uh, so somehow, jitna I se ho paya, I tried to manage it and largely ho gaya tha. So there was one question which I mujhe P block mein confusion tha. Uh, usme, I think there was some conflicting information given in the table of NCRT and the text of NCRT. So I was confused between uh, the two, ki, kiske saath, what I should go ahead with. And I, I don't think I got that right either. So eventually, wo bhi galati hua tha. So I got two questions wrong in chemistry and one of them was uh, this question from P block in particular. Uh, so that was that, Baki, I think I finished my paper dot at 3 hours and I had 10-15 minutes for revision. So I paper 2 hours 45 minutes mein kar liya hoga, and I took my entire time of 15 minutes to do my revision. Thankfully for me personally, uh, the invigilators in our center were all good. And the pen was functional, the table was right, all the things were right and the clock was available. Thi. So in that sense, mein sahi tha. Matlab, not everybody is lucky with their invigilator, sometimes they're really talkative. So in that case, I think it's a good idea to politely request them so that you can focus on your paper. But I really didn't face that problem. So yeah, that was that for my three hours. And then I went outside, I was obviously quite happy. Not about the fact that my paper had gone well, but that this all of this was over and the two years of preparation had come to an end. And then I met my parents who had been waiting there excitedly for I don't know like four, four and a half hours since the time they dropped me. And I mean they were just as excited to see me. And they just saw that I was very happy. So they thought that I had done a 720 paper. Kar hai. But uh, obviously that wasn't the case. But I ended up getting a decent score. I got 690 out of 720. And uh, 
वही जो क्वेश्चन कुछ मैंने आपको बताया बायो और केमिस्ट्री में गलत हुए बट माई वन लर्निंग फ्रॉम दिस प्रोसेस और फिर एनी बडी एनी ऑफ माई जूनियर्स ऑल्सो वो आस्ट मी अबाउट द प्रोसेस ऑफ अटैम्प्टिंग द पेपर देर इज़ वन थिंग आई वुल से इट्स वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट कि आपने जो पढ़ा है अपने दो साल में उसको आप कंक्लूजन पर ला पाओ वो तीन घंटों में अदरवाइज इट विल नॉट बी फ्रूटफुल कि आपने जो भी मेहनत करी है तो उस टाइम पर आपकी नॉलेज से बहुत ज़्यादा ये इंपॉर्टेंट है कि आप मतलब एक तो कॉम्पिटिशन से ना घबराओ और दूसरा कि आप मतलब शांति से पेपर करते जाओ कि योर एम शुड ओनली हैव टू बी द क्वेश्चन उस टाइम पे आपके दिमाग में रिजल्ट कॉलेज ड्रीम्स एस्पिरेशन कुछ भी नहीं होना चाहिए मतलब इट्स ओनली द क्वेश्चन एंड इट्स ओनली यू नथिंग एल्स सो दैट इज़ समथिंग आई वुड लाइक टू टेल ऑल ऑफ यू दो इफ यू गोइंग टू बी गिविंग द नीट पेपर एंड दैट वॉज अबाउट माई नीट जर्नी एंड आई विन हैविंग अ ग्रेट टाइम एट कॉलेज सिंस देन एंड आई थिंक आई वुड आई वुड मतलब टू एक्सपीरियंस दिस लाइफ दैट एन एम बी बी एस कॉलेज गिवज यू I I would very happily go through that entire process again, give that uh, exam again. So I mean, all I'm trying to say is that your efforts will be worth it. The course is worth it. The paper is worth it. And uh, just keep that in mind. And if you have any other queries or any other videos you would want to, uh, you would want me to cover, uh, you can message me or you can leave them in the comment section. Thank you so much for watching.